right, friends, for our story today, we have a story called One Monkey, Too Many. And it was written by Jackie French Cobbler and illustrated by Lynn Munsinger. All right, let's see what happens. One, said the bikeman. This bike is for one. One monkey can ride it, and one can have fun. See, it's got one seat. But as soon as the bikeman went back to his shop, one monkey too many jumped onto the bike. One monkey too many wheeled off down the pike. Hooray! The two shouted. We're having such fun. This bike is far better for two than for one. So how many bike how many monkeys are on the bike? One, two monkeys. Then bingo, the bike hit a bump in the road. It started to wobble, it started to pitch. One monkey too many crashed into the ditch. Uh oh. Two, said the golfer. This cart is for two. If you're looking for fun, this is perfect for you. But as soon as those rascals climbed into their seats, one monkey too many hopped in between. One monkey too many rolled off across the green. Uh-oh, how many monkeys are there? There's one, two, three monkeys. Uh-oh, there was three, but it was only meant for two monkeys. Yippee! They all wiggled and giggled with glee. This card is made for two, is fantastic for three. They zoomed up a hill and they started back down. Then, oh no! They exclaimed as they jumped, jammed on the brake. One monkey too many <gasps> splashed into the lake. Oh no! Three, said the boatman. This canoe is for three. There's a seat on each end plus one more, don't you see? But just as the boatman was pushing them off, one monkey too many swung into the boat and one monkey too many aboard and afloat. Uh-oh. They paddled quite nicely away from the shore. See, they said smugly, it's just fine with four. But soon up ahead came the roar of the falls. Yikes! They all screeched and they tried hard to stop. But one monkey too many had quite a long drop. Uh-oh. Four, said the waiter. This table's for four. You'll be far too crowded if you try to fit more. But, of course, while the waiter was getting their drinks, one monkey too many squeezed into a seat. One monkey too many demanded to eat. See here, they declared as the waiter returned. Five fit just fine. Please do not be concerned. Then out came the dinners and forks started flying. Drinks spilled and plates tumbled and monkeys got rude. One monkey too many got covered with food. Uh-oh, they did not listen. And he said only four. And they tried to fit five. And look at the mess they made. That's why, friends, we need to use our listening ears. Five, said the bellman. This bed is for five. I cannot allow any more to arrive. But the minute the bellman unloaded their bags, one monkey too many poked out his small head. One monkey too many crept into the bed. Uh-oh. See, they agreed with a stretch and a yawn. We all fit quite nicely. The bellman was wrong. But as soon as they started to toss and to turn, to kick and to twist and to sputter and snore, one monkey too many ended up in a war. Six, said the author. This book is for six. 
the pages are full, so no more of your tricks. But that noon, when the author went for some lunch, one monkey too many came sneaking in and look! One monkey too many got into this book! Friends, our book ended up with way more monkeys than just six. Look at them all. Oh my goodness, friends. That was our story called One Monkey Too Many. Thanks for reading with me.